everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Dr. Brianna Whiteside and I create faith, fashion, lifestyle, and finance content. And so if you're here, that must mean that you're interested in one or more of these topics. Because I want you to stay connected and I don't want you to miss out, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and liking this video because it really helps me in the algorithm and keeps me motivated. You know, when I see people following the, the channel and watching the videos, it lets me know that I'm on the right track. So if you can, you know, go ahead and do that for me. Give me some encouragement. That'd be most helpful. In today's video, I want to share with you another dream that I had um, this weekend. And I don't just think this dream is for me. I think this dream is for the larger body of Christ, believers, kingdom citizens, folks who've been following Jesus and been rocking with him and waiting for his word to be accomplished in the earth. Y'all, this message is for you. So as I said in the previous video, I've been dreaming a lot lately. I think God is really trying to communicate his idea, his mind and prepare a lot of people for what's coming next. And I don't think, and I do, while I do understand that, you know, negative things will be happening in the world, I think that positive things and a lot of them is gonna be happening in the kingdom. And so I wanna also be a voice to share some encouragement to you, share what God is showing me. And I want you to be hopeful because I know what it's like to <laughs> have the journey slap the taste out your mouth, okay? I know what that's like. And so I want to provide some edification for you and tell you what God is sharing with me and what I believe. So this weekend I had a dream that I was in my bedroom looking out the bedroom window and I saw money coming from one realm into the other. I don't know if you've ever seen the Umbrella Academy. Well, the Umbrella Academy is a um a series on netflix it's like a superhero series type of thing and one of the the characters in the umbrella academy has the ability to uh to leave one realm and go into another realm so for time travel that's what it is he has the ability to time travel or or location travel right so he blinks one one moment he's about to run and he leaves the current location and goes into another location. And that is really what I saw coming out of heaven. I saw like money coming from one location to the other location. Now, y'all, I stay on the third floor, right? I stay on the third floor of my apartment building. And I really believe that me being on the top floor is symbolic um, of, you know, where this money is coming from. It's not just coming from, you know, the world. This money, this wealth transfer is coming from heaven. And the fact that I saw it coming from one realm into another aggressively, like like it was like somebody was throwing it and forcing it into the earth. That's what really excited me because I've heard a lot of voices say, you know, there's a wealth transfer and I really sense that there is a wealth transfer, but I've always been like, God, is the wealth transfer for me? You know what I'm saying? Is it for me? Is it gonna happen? How does it happen? What should I be doing, you know? really inquiring of the Lord and I believe he gave me that dream to let me know yeah no the transfer is happening aggressively as a matter of fact it's already happened in the spirit and now it's starting to manifest in the natural and the fact that I just saw it like forcefully appearing from and I was clear that it was one realm to another right lets me know that we are closer to seeing it manifest than we really believe like i feel like it's happening very 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 soon and another reason why i feel like it's happening soon is because god has really been impressing on me to start spending more time with him and plotting out a plan for where this money will go you know, so I don't just think God wants me to just be debt free and my family to be debt free. I think that there's a larger global um, reach for this money. I think that we are to go into the world and let our light shine. And so I believe that this money is also attached to other neighborhoods and other people. And so he's really been encouraging me to, you know, seek him on what to do with it. Ask for wisdom, right? Ask for wisdom. I'm reminded of, I think it's Solomon who uh, inherited the kingdom um, and God basically visited him in dream and said, At, what should I give you, I think, or maybe it wasn't a dream. Look, don't let, I'm telling you this off the top of my head. Okay, go, go read the Bible for yourself. But I really believe that it was him and um, he asked for wisdom. 
He asks for wisdom because he's like, you know, yo, my father David has ruled the kingdom and he's done well and I'm new to this thing. I don't know how to do this thing. And so I need wisdom. And God basically said, because you didn't ask me for, you know, money or because you didn't ask me for um, the heads of your enemies, I'm going to give you the wisdom and you're gonna not only gonna be the wisest person, but you're gonna be very wealthy. And so I really believe that is what God is, you know, impressing upon us to do. Seek him for what we need to do. Yes, get your house in order. Yes, take care of your family, but there is a larger responsibility that we have as kingdom citizens. Um for this money. This ain't just for us to go splurge. This ain't just for us to, uh, you know, just be tricking off. This is really for us to affect change in the world and become the salt and the salt of the earth and the light of the world that the world needs. And how many people know that one reason we have been behind is because a lot of kingdom citizens, we broke. A lot of folks are broke, okay? And even if you're not broke, you don't, you may not have as not enough money or as much money as you want right i'm not broke okay so i don't even want to um prophesy that over my life i'm not broke but i don't have as not enough resources to do as much good in the world as i want to do and i believe that that's one reason why god put on my heart to kind of start um seeking him because you know when this money comes into my hand I, it's not time for me to try to figure it out. I should already know, hey, this is going here, this is going there, these things are allocated, and start to actually do the resource to have the systems in place in order to properly manage um, God's resources, right? And so I want you to know that the wealth transfer is happening very swiftly. Uh, folks ain't lying about it. Everybody ain't gonna tell the same lie. Money is coming to the hands of the righteous, but we need to be wise. We need to be wise and manage it properly. So I, I just wanted to share that. I hope this video encouraged you. Share it with someone who may be believing God for the wealth transfer. Stand on it for yourself and uh, consider all the resources that I have on BriannaWhiteside.com. I have tons of eBooks. Subscribe to my mailing list because you don't wanna miss out on some of the emails that I'm gonna be sending. And just stay encouraged, y'all. I know the journey has been wearisome. I know the journey has left the taste out your mouth, but recompense is coming, okay? Restoration is coming. Wealth is coming, right? You know there's a scripture that says, hope deferred makes the heart sick, but when it springs forth, it's a tree of life, something like that. Uh, I'm notorious for not knowing where a, a scripture is in the Bible. Let me just say that. Anyway, it's about to spring forth. <laughs> All of the things that you've been waiting for are about to spring forth. And you want to know why? Because you have waited on the Lord. You have done what you were supposed to do. And not only if, even if you did mess up, even if you didn't follow God as closely, he's your father and he is a giver of good gifts. Okay. So because he's your father and because he has um, an obligation to take care of you and because this money is for his name's sake too, he going he gonna to bring it to you. If he can trust you, he going to bring it to you. So let this be an encouragement to you that it's on the way. Prepare, prepare, prepare. You ain't seen half the money that's about to come into the hands of the righteous. So prepare your heart, prepare your mind, prepare your spirit. Um, and yeah, subscribe to my channel if you aren't. And share this with a friend. I will see you soon. Bye.